After Friday's solid growth, oil kicked off the new trading week with some losses. This decline can be seen as a rebound following a steady upward movement. Oil prices are currently being weighed down exclusively by technical factors. The situation around colonial pipelines shutdown is no longer a factor affecting crude prices. At the same time, there are no other drivers for the oil market. However, this incident has raised the issue of the need for more active steps to reduce oil consumption and switch to other energy sources. Therefore, such a fundamental factor will undoubtedly put pressure on the oil market, which means that its short-term bullish run is limited. On Friday, Brent crude oil futures showed quite strong upside momentum. As a result, the price was able to recover after its decline on May 12 and 13. Given that Brent crude has recently topped the local high of the midterm trend, rising to $69.99 from $68.65, it can be argued that market sentiment is bullish. If the price consolidates above $70, the volume of long positions will most likely increase, dragging the quote even higher. Currently, the price is still pulling back from its peak. As for the US WTI crude, the level of $68 can be seen as a reference point for stronger upside momentum. However, the benchmark is currently trading at $65 per barrel. Last week, the US dollar versus the Russian ruble pair slid and the ruble added about 1%. Notably, the trading chart shows that the Russian currency has been strengthening for several weeks from the price level of 78 rubles per dollar. Regarding the current fluctuations, it can be seen that the Russian currency is standing still. The quotes are moving in a range between the levels of 73.50 and 74.70. In this case, the best trading tactic is to trade with a view to breaking through one or another border of the price range. There's a similar situation with the euro-ruble pair. Last week, traders locally supported the Russian currency. The quotes dropped to 89.18, .18, but then pulled back to the level of 90. Currently, the euro-ruble pair is moving in the range between 89.20 and 90.45. It is also worth considering that since April 22, the ruble has gained in value by more than 3.5% against the euro. The ruble started the new trading week at about Friday's closing price. In fact, the ruble has been trading in a clear sideways trend for almost two days. This is largely due to the fact that the macroeconomic calendar is bereft of any important releases that could affect investor sentiment. Nevertheless, other currencies, including the euro and the pound sterling, were able to slightly advance against the US dollar. Globally, the US dollar is losing in value. Thus, the obvious question is, what is holding back the potential growth of the Russian currency? In fact, this stems from permanent geopolitical tensions putting downward pressure on the ruble. That's all for now. Thank you for watching and have a nice trading day. Bye!